Hey everyone, welcome back to my channel. We are at Valley Village right now, of course, doing some thrifting. I am still looking for a lot of the stuff that I was looking for last time, but this time I just really feel like getting a lot of like colors and patterns right now. I'm not sure why, maybe because it's like freaking freezing and I'm just ready for spring to come. So while I am looking for like cowboy boots, I'm also looking for like maybe some like silky pattern pants and like some sort of like comfy spring set. And I really wanna find like a quilted coat or I want to buy a quilt and make a coat. Um, so that's my plan, that's what I'm looking for, so let's go inside. I think I made a grave error because it's seniors day today and it's super busy, so oops. So I'm in the jeans now and I'm looking for like some high-waisted stuff. Oh, but I forgot to bring a tape measure like someone suggested, so I can't tell if it's high-rise, but I'll take a guess. I love these so much. I love the watch. I am in the sleeveless tops now. I'm just looking for something like silky and patterned and soft and fun. This is kind of cute. I think I like it. I would want it to be like fitted. You guys, I finally found cargo pants. Currently in the like pajama stuff because I want to find like silk pants and maybe like a comfy set. And I feel like I can maybe find it here, so let's check it out. I've been wanting just like a silk vintage robe for the home. Um, and I would get this, but the tie is gone, which is super sad. I guess we won't get it. In the sweaters, we're looking for bright and colorful. <laughs> this weave is too open for me, plus it's like all acrylic. I love this color, but I'm not so sure about the fabric. Oh my god, you guys, I just have to show you this. It's not my size and it's wool, so it's super itchy, but look how beautiful this vintage sweater is. It's vintage Hudson's Bay. I kind of want to get it. I am in the runners, and um, these look actually kind of cute. Really beat up, but I might try them on. They are cute, but they're just like the tiniest bit too small for me. I'm looking specifically for like a slouchy bag, preferably suede. I kind of like just this very simple black purse. I am sure it's vintage mid England. Cowboy boots or block heels? They are too big. In the jackets here, I'm looking for something quilted. I am here in the men's section looking for like those like 2000s shirts that guys used to wear that are like kind of thick. Um, yeah, that's it. I love this color, but it's a little bit too plain. I would like this, but in a different fabric. Both of these are cute. I recently bought something like this but purple, but I also like the red. Oh my god, I really, really like this. It's cute. Okay, so we have to pare this down. So this is cute, but I think it will be just too, too oversized. I do wish there were change rooms. Okay, I think this might be perfect. I really like it. These look, unfortunately, very low rise. I got the goods. <laughs> so, I got a lot of stuff. I think I really hit the jackpot on a couple things, but I'm not really gonna know until I try them on. So, I will see you guys at the try-on. Welcome back. Um, I have everything 
right here. So let's just start with the haul. And we're gonna start with the shirts. So this might be one of the coolest things I've ever found at the thrift store. It's like this vintage Hudson's Bay cable knit sweater. It's cream, it was made in Ireland. I'm pretty sure that it's wool, obviously. It doesn't really say, um, but it's like very, very old Hudson's Bay. It kind of just caught my eye in a different section that I wasn't even looking in. Um, and I picked it up and I was like, this is gonna be oversized on me, but I kind of gotta have it, it's so cool. I did find a couple more shirts in the men's section with that like 2000s boy aesthetic, um, which I just think is super funny. I don't know why I call it that, like it's probably not actually called that. Anyways, the first one is Gap and it is gray with like a blue stripe through it. I just think it would be cute with some like straight leg or like wide leg white jeans. Untucked and just like oversized like this would be really, really cute. It was 10.49 and it also just feels super comfortable so I think I'll be using this to lounge in and also go out in um, yeah I really do like it. The next shirt I also found in the men's section and I'm kind of regretting it because I have something similar to it, but it is this red Levi's long sleeve. But again, I just thought it would be cute untucked over top of some like straight leg jeans. I have something so similar. It's just more purple than red. <laughs> um, so I might exchange this one. I don't know. Maybe once I try it on, I will absolutely love it and we'll keep it. We'll see. So let's move on to some accessories. I got this really cool green wool bucket hat. I I have never seen anything so cool in my entire life. Um, it is vintage, it was made in England and it's mostly Angora, but like other stuff too. It was in the men's section, but like I feel like it's a unisex thing, whatever. I just thought it was so cool, I had to get it. It would be super cool for spring with like some trench coats or like a duster coat. And I'm just a really big fan of this color too. I think it's so nice. The other accessory I got was just this simple little black bag. Um, there's nothing really special to it. It's not even leather. It was also only $4.99, which I thought was a great deal. But I like that I can fit a lot of things in it. I also think it will go with a lot of stuff. I think it it might be one of my new staple bags. The final item I got was a pair of jeans and I think the wash is so so cool. They're old navy but I think they're like an older old navy because I don't recognize this tag but I just think they're really cute. I think they'll be a really good fit. I haven't tried them on yet but I think they're gonna be so cute for so many different outfits and they were only at $7.49 but I'm also just realizing that they slightly smell like smoke which is disappointing. I'm not sure what to do about that. Okay and with that that was everything that I got. For me I think my favorite items might be the hat and the Hudson's Bay sweater. I think those are just so cool. Anyways, if you like this video, leave a like and let me know what your favorite piece was down in the comments below. And if you want to see more videos from me, subscribe. I hope you guys have a great rest of your week and I'll see you next time. Bye.